Signing in and removing account on the RCA tablet. If you already have a Google account, then there is no need to set up a new account. You can use your existing Gmail account to sign in. Select the settings icon. On the left of the screen, scroll down and select add account. A screen will show up showing you the different types of accounts you can set up. You want to select Google. Select existing to sign in using your existing Gmail account. In the sign in page, enter your username and select next. Then enter your password and select next. The next step will ask you if you want to join Google+. You can always do that later. Click not now to skip. Some apps are paid apps, so you can set up credit card to pay for your apps, but this is not necessary in order to use the device. Select not now to continue, or select set up credit card if you want to set up your credit card information to pay for apps that require payment. The next step will ask you if you want to back up your information on the tablet to your Google account. Select the gray right arrow and you will be finished setting up your Google account. The screen will automatically go back to the settings page. You will now see under accounts the Google icon signifying that the account is set up. Select Google and you will see your account show up on the right side of the screen. If for any reason you wanted to remove the account that is set up on the RCA tablet, then it is just as easy. Select the settings icon. On the left of the screen, scroll down and select Google that is listed under account. Your account will show up on the top right side of the screen. Select your account. Then you will see three little squares in a column on the top right corner of the screen. Select the icon and you will be provided with two options, sync and remove account. Select remove account, then confirm and the account will be removed from the device. Now when you go back to the settings page and scroll down to accounts, you will see that there is no account set up. We hope this tutorial was helpful to you. For more information, go to rcatablets.com.